Hello guys, today we will discuss two lines of code from open source project Pinkery related to route model binding. I found an interesting case which may be interesting to you as well. So what is that route bind in the app service provider and why would you need that and how does it work? And also related route bind username related line is username here within route group. So let me show you how it works in the browser, in the real project, and then we will discuss the code. Here I am on the Pinkery project, which is powered by that open source code, and here's my personal profile. And this is a great way to demonstrate the binding by username, because look at the URL, add and my username, and also the second URL powered by the same route group is my username, questions, and then ID of the question. Basically on Pinkery people can ask questions to other users. So the first thing to discuss is this username parameter. Did you know that you can provide the parameter to route group like in this case? So the prefix for the URLs in that group is not just add symbol, it's add username which is dynamic. And then what happens in the controller, controller doesn't have any parameter except for that username. And this is the code for that user controller show method with route model binding to user model. So Laravel will automatically look for the field of users.username in the database. In a similar fashion, username parameter is automatically passed to the second controller, which has two parameters questions question and also username and the controller for that looks like this question controller method user and question both using route model binding so user is found by users username column in the database and question is found by id which happens to be a longer uuid this parameter powered by question model i've opened that as well has UUIDs trait, enables UUIDs to be used. So the first thing I wanted to demonstrate and emphasize it to you that you can create route group with a parameter which is automatically passed to all the controllers within that group. And then the second part is that username is resolved by a magic kind of hook called route bind in the app service provider, which overrides the default behavior. So whenever you call, for example, user find or fail or user find by username, Laravel or Eloquent, instead of just building where username equals parameter, will replace that with this user where lowercase of the username column in the database equals to lowercase of the username as a parameter, which enables usernames to be both uppercase and lowercase. And my username is a great example for that. So I have name and surname uppercase in my case, but if I change that to both lowercase, the URL will still work. To be honest, I'm not sure about the effect of that on SEO. Perhaps it should be a redirect to another username instead of having two different URLs working. So this may be not the best example to illustrate, but I just wanted to show you that you can override how typical parameter in eloquent find or fail or first or fail is resolved and you can define that in route bind in your app service provider. So yeah, two kind of related things that I've noticed in the open source project Pinkery. It is available on GitHub and I will link that in the description below. If you want more videos like this one, subscribe to the channel. I will keep shooting daily videos as the channel is called Laravel Daily. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.